Welcome to another segment of Manifest with SII Power with your host Dwight Lee. And on this segment, we're going to be talking about the basics of metaphysics. <clears throat> Before we quantum jump into that, if you've been getting uh, great value out of the channel, the content expressed on the channel, and you're really enjoying the channel, please consider subscribing to the channel by hitting the subscribe button, turn the notification bell on so you get notifications when a new video drops, and don't forget to like and comment on your favorite video. Also, the thumbs up helps with uh, harmonizing with the algorithm to help others find this uh, valuable content. <clears throat> the basics of metaphysics. All right, so we have three fundamental principles that the teachers teach that teach metaphysics. And that's self-observation, definition of aim, and then detachment. So until you locate the self that's deceiving you, you're unfit and disqualified uh, for basically uh, evolving, emerging into your higher authentic self, right? So definition of aim, right? That's, that's delving into um, the core purpose, the essential purpose, the essence of why you incarnated in here, right? You have a a vision and a mission and a purpose, right? And then detachment. So going through this process, you would detach, right, from the unwanted reality to the desired reality through dwelling in your wish fulfilled. Now, Neville talks a lot about uh, reactions to life and being the observer. And this is important because this is the only way that you can begin to see yourself because if you're not woke the first thing that you need is the awareness and as you become more and more self-aware you begin to see your reactions in life right we have two choices all the time we can either react or we can respond reacting puts us on the hamster wheel a vicious cycle of failure right until we unless we correct it but even better than that, we can stand in our power and we can choose to respond. Meaning we could ask empowering questions because if you ask the wrong set of questions, you'll end up on the inaccurate side of the equation. If you ask the right set of questions, you'll end up on the accurate side of the equation. What do I mean by accurate questions? Meaning like, what is this coming to show me? What is this revealing me to me? What is this showing me? What can I learn from this? You know, so I don't have to keep taking the same lesson. All of this is important. And as you increase your self-awareness by being the observer, you can begin to interrupt the patterns, right? The paradigms, the programming, the conditioning that's outplaying in your subconscious mind, right? Through awareness, right? Through mindset, through self-concept, right? and marrying your thoughts and feelings, right? In imagination, right? The real world, you can overcome all of these things very easily because you are the chief operant power, right? You're only limited by the limits that you accept. And this is basically the basics of metaphysics, right? What is the purpose of metaphysics, right? It's to bring about the new birth or radical psychological change help you uh, emerge perpetually into the next best version of yourself, right? Neville says it this way. You're already the person that you desire to be. Your unwillingness to believe it is the willing that, reason that you don't see this, right? And then he also said, though it be false, an assumption persistent in, will harden into fact. These are powerful, explosive, electrifying teachings. Don't let these words just go over your head. Dig into this. This is the Breakfast of Champions. We've been live on Manifest with SII Power with your host Dwight Lee, talking about the basics of metaphysics and the purpose of metaphysics. I'm going to leave you with this quote from Paracelsus. The human spirit is so great a thing that could we rightly comprehend the mind of man, nothing would be impossible to man. Paracelsus and then Henry David Thoreau. If one advances confidently in the directions of his dreams and endeavors to live the life which he has imagined, 
he will meet with success unexpected in common hours.